Street. Hold up, one. God, I've been to a lot of the movie theaters here in Tampa, and I'm sorry, it's the same everywhere I go. You got these wimpy ass doormen. Have you seen these? Yeah, these little Pee Wee Hermans that are on the front doors. Yeah, you can you can sneak in. You can sneak into that second movie. It's <laughs> it's no it's history, man. But I wondered what it would be like if we had some real men on these front doors of these movie theaters. Yeah, somebody like Clint Eastwood taking tickets at a local movie theater. Uh -huh. I know what you're thinking, punk. Did he tear six tickets or did he only tear five? <laughs> Well, actually, in all this confusion, I lost count myself. I bet that just makes your day, doesn't it? And being that you have the tickets there in your hand and you can count them, I think you just better ask yourself a question. Do I feel lucky? You know, that's a good thing. I'm talking about Oh, there's simply a real man guarding these theaters. Arnold Schwarzenegger guarding a the theater. Is a local movie theater? Yeah. That way you got some guy with his feet up on the seats causing problems. Arnie walks in there. Thank you for coming to movies at Mission Bar. <laughs> we appreciate your business, but get your feet on the seats or I will kill you. <laughs> I'm talking about. Are you Charles Bronson doing that job, right? Hey, kid. This woman says you're making a lot of noise. <laughs> it won't bother you anymore, man. Enjoy the movie. You know, that's the kind of thing I'm talking about. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if the Muppets like ran a movie theater here in Tampa? Wouldn't that be wild? You go up to the front ticket counter and there's Miss Piggy waiting to take your money, right? Oh, hello! Jokes. I think that's America. <laughs> yeah, 